youngsters, 18 and older, between 18 and 25, let us have us a little talk about the new stimulus package. Yes, just for you all, because you all will be the ones who will be paying for it, along with your uh, grandchildren. And uh, Greta Thunberg should have joined this cause because they are stealing your future. And how will they pay for it? By taking more tax dollars from you youngsters. You know, where everybody wants to go to $15 an hour. While this tweet is up, let's do a little addition. Bread. Just your basic bread loaf, even from Walmart. It's what, like two dollars now? Minimum wage is seven fifty. So when it goes to fifteen dollars an hour, you'll be paying five dollars for that loaf of bread. It's a third. Think about that before you all start. Oh, we need to raise the minimum wage. When you raise minimum wage, prices of products go up. It doesn't take a rocket scientist to figure that out. By the way, I don't claim to be a Christian. But as in the Bible says, give a devil its due. Which means give unto Caesar what is Caesar's. Fools! Here is why you need to contact all your senators because this thing has already passed the house. Yeah, the Democrats have already passed this in the House. So now it's time for you youngsters between 18 and 25 to get on the phone to your senators and say, Hey, I don't eat pork. Now if you're a Bernie bro, you're going to not bother calling your senators because this is what it says. Left's Social Justice Agenda. Bernie Bros. I'm just going to call your attention to a few of these things here on the screen because I'm going to actually leave a link in the description so that you all can follow this if you aren't lazy. By the way, just so you know, I'm an ex-con. I don't agree with this. This is a bunch of crap. When you get out of the joint, you're healthy as can be. Why? Because they feed you. They give you three meals in a cot. And you don't have to worry about anything immunization because they take care of all that stuff if you want it. Now, they were preaching that we were racist, the conservative party. Yeah, I'm a convict. I can't vote, but I'm conservative. I was born a free man. I believed in the Constitution of the United States of America. Why? Because it has the few amendments that help me. I have been telling you all that these people that you all elected, the demon rats, what I call them, but you can call them Democrat, Democrat, Democrats, whatever. Uh, yeah, check this out. Oh, yeah, 120% of their debt, and get this, basis of race and ethnicity, can you believe that? Now, if that don't speak racism, I don't know what does. Giving when they haven't even spent is crazy. Uh, what do you all think about it? Leave a comment in this comment section because if you can see as I see that is unspent but yet they're gonna go ahead and give them some more give them some more give them some more and all that give them some more you youngsters are gonna be paying out the wall through for it in your future and possibly your kids that you have now. 
maybe stretch into the, your grandchildren. Well, I can say this much. I do know why that New York, California, and Pennsylvania stayed in, along with uh, Whitmer. I can't remember which state it was. Yeah. Check that out, would you? Pay them for shutting you down. Hmm. Yeah. What about the people that are already out of business? Did you ever come to think about that? Oh, yeah. How about you there, pipeline workers? You voted for him. Yeah, you stuck your neck way out there. And he took a ginsu and cut it off. This one, I guess, is going to benefit New York City the most. But I thought the fares that we pay every day on a bus or subway was supposed to go for paying the people's wages, uh, upkeep, maintenance. But evidently, it's not paying it. Somebody must be pocketing it. Or they're going to pocket what comes there. There's a good one for you youngsters to think about. Yeah, how about that? There's some more, what do you call that, pork pocket money? Yeah, that's what it looks like to me. And y'all going to pay for it. And man, if this ain't rich... Because I'm pretty sure we had us a little uh, thing about the unspent funds. And they actually gave a total as to how much was not spent. But yet they want to give more. And they haven't spent what was sent. Now, who's taking money home? And... Why do you youngsters want to pay for their little, oh, I want this and I want that so I can take this and put it in my pocket? And the reason I say that is because it seems like right here in front of my face, I mean, two and two make four. Correct me if I'm wrong. But didn't the uh, Democrats actually uh, mm -hmm, kind of screw Canada? Uh, you know, they closed down a pipeline, but yet they want to do this. How does it feel, pipeline workers, that when you vote the way you voted, how does it feel now? How do you Feel. I hope you feel the pain that everybody else is feeling. Because the longer this person you installed, you didn't vote for him, you installed him in office, keeps dicking you around. Democrats that don't like my fucking language, get off my fucking station. You know why? Because I'm a convict that don't give a fuck about you installing that piece of fucking garbage into the office. Even though I'm taking up for your stupid ass. YouTube, demonetize him. Ooh, he hurt my motherfucking feelings. Boo hoo hoo, wah wah wah. As Tom McDonald says in his video, I'm the sponsor of my video. I don't need any outside influence, just like Trump said. And he actually put it on Joe on the second debate. That motherfucker needed everything he could get his hands on. That's right. Yeah, and I guarantee you, he still ain't spent none of it. Probably got it in his bank. 
sharing it with his son so he can go get high again. Or maybe go over to the Philippines so he can have sex with 16-year-olds. Yeah, it's supposed to be legal over there, but, uh, you know, I'm no. My ex-girlfriend's mama used to say, you ain't through shitting yellow yet. And I'm talking about the women over, uh, the girls over there in the Philippines that have sex with idiots that go over there. Well, I'm going to leave it at this. Leave a like in the comment section. Leave a dislike. Make a comment that you liked it, you didn't like it. Subscribe to the channel if you think I'm doing a decent job of explaining a few things that I don't see mainline media capturing because they still have that CCP narrative to push because they're owned with 40% stock by the CCP. But other than that, have a nice day.